Hey everybody, it's Matt Calder. Welcome back to another Matt Checks Out. This is Dimensionals. Uh, this looks great. I saw my friend Fawn play it, Fawn and Games. Go check them out. Uh, this is a three player party based sort of hero RPG uh, with, with roguelike leveling elements. This looks neat. The design of the characters really grabbed me. Um, and it's Steam Next Fest, so hey, check out the demos, see what you like. Uh, there's, there's, there's no risk, right? That's the idea. Uh, poke around, poke this. No, nope. oh, that's weird. I poked that and it tried to get me to join the Discord. That's, there's nothing there. All right, that's weird. Um, oh. Oh, cool, there's a campaign. That's, that's, I, it's probably not in the demo, but that's good that that exists. Uh, let's let's go through the tutorial. Let's go through the tutorial. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh wow. Uh, Koa? Wow, this is in, this is amazing. This is amazing production already. Oh, are these the dimensionals? Stand back, kid. We've got this. Dimensionals is a great Saturday sort of Saturday morning hero team name <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, okay. He's a, so he's a street shark. Shork. Okay, so Shork is the best is what I'm hearing. That perfect. Okay, so Shork and friends. So he's the he's the newest hero in the dimensionals. My boy, Gramps. Gramps. Welcome to the mothership, my boy. Home of the dimensionals. Sick. Cool start. Love it. Love the voice acting. Love the designs. Gramps, what? Good to see you, my boy. Looks like we picked you up right in the nick of time. I know I've got a lot of explaining to do, so how about we... Gramps? Sorry to break up the family reunion, but we've got trouble. Magmama? Okay, this, listen, calm down. We've got specters appearing all around the ship. What, how are they here too? Ask them yourself. They're already inside, all hands engage. Oh, they're in the, they're in the ship as well. Whoa, okay. More of the purple guys. <laughs> I, I appreciate Gramps. You're dimensional now, Koa. Time to fight. How do I, huh? Simple, drag your skills on an enemy to attack. Drag my what? You'll figure it out. Oh, we got 200 G. Okay, good to know. Fight. Drag and drop your skills to activate them. So it's the one down there. Dragging a skill. Dropping a block skill when your heroes mitigates incoming damage. Each skill has an associated mana cost. Playing your turns out wisely. You strike a balance between dealing damage and staying healthy. So you're gonna hit me for five damage. Give me 10 block, easy peasy. Um, that was all my mana, right? Yes, zero of one mana. Okay, classic. And then does my mana ramp every turn or do I just get one for this little starter thing? Two out of two. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So now I can say, hey, you do that. So five damage. 
plot to target enemy one time and apply weak. Five damage to a target twice. Okay, I have a 20% crit chance. He gets 10 block at the start. At the start of all battle, all heroes heal one HP. Good crit. Victory. Oh. Oh. Oh, we're picking this. Uh, the first equip this hero casts each turn also deals an additional five damage to all enemies. Love that. Um, ten damage target enemy. Yes. Equipping your heroes. Drag and drop skills to move them between your heroes in the inventory. Equipping the right skills. Create powerful combos. Need extra gold. Drag them to the shopkeep. And you can heal outside of battle. Give him this one. He's got. Let's let's give you it. Yeah, you know, mix and match the skills a little bit. I don't know if you can replace them. We'll figure it out. Spectre's called a screamer, relatively harmless on its own. Gives its allies a barrier, making them harder to dispatch. This is the screamer. Collecting two copies of the same rank one skill allow you to combine them and increase their rank. Drag identical. Oh. Skills can be further enhanced by creating two rank two skills into a rank three. Upgrading your skills is a core part of creating powerful builds. Okay, so what I want to do is do that. Mm hmm. Enemy intense, allowing attacks from enemies. I'll show you how much damage they're doing. Yep, classic, love that. In this sort of game, I really enjoy seeing what the enemies are gonna do. Really lets you spend your mana, lets you know what you're, what, what's up. Um, well, let's listen. He's got, he, he comes in with 10 block. He'll be all right. He'll be all right. to him and uh, oh that takes two so that's good to know that's good to remember that takes two mana yeah that's gonna do 20 damage I had a like small hit, you know. I wonder if that means they'll lose that shield. Yep, that's what I thought. Bada bing, bada boom. Nice and easy. Now, see, some skills you can't use again, so that's a that's a that's a good thing to keep in mind. Of like, you know, this this defense he can refresh. Some skills can't do that, so don't don't get too excited. Rare passive. When any hero deals a critical hit, deal an additional five to the target, max ten times per turn. Well, let's. Mm, yeah, listen, let's take the rare passive, you know? Give him the rare passive.
Luckily, those are the only ones that managed to get inside the ship. We've got SOS calls coming in from every dimension. This isn't good. The Spectres have never been this organized before. Mama, I'm taking Koa and Bop with me. We're going out to help as many of the dimensionals as we can. Send me the location of those SOS calls. You got it, boss. Shopkeep. Yo-ho. What the? A giant talking rat? You boys look like you're in the market for some new gear. I'm always in the market for new gear. Is he one of the dimensionals? Is his name Shopkeep? Seems like you're in a smashing specters kind of mood. Koa, take a look. We'll need to prepare for the battles ahead. <laughs> it's a pleasure to meet your wallet, little dimensional. Listen, I'm, I'm always in the new gear state of mind. Uh, skill shop will be restocked for new skills. The restock cost goes up on each click, but don't worry, it'll reset back to the starting cost each time you enter the shop after completing a battle. This, this is great. Love this. Uh, we're gonna get this one. This one. Uh. Oh. Well then. Let's buy another This Is Fine. I guess it has to take effect. Well, you know, I, I, I like that ability to uh, to to adjust things outside of this, you know, get get other bonuses, other benefits. No time for sightseeing. Magmama will send us the coordinates for the SOS signals. Let's give it our all, boop. Oh, we can choose who we want to fight. Well, okay then. I thought we'd have the ability to do a little, uh, a little equipment, but... What happens if you just ignore them? They explode. It hurts. Oh, it's kind of cute, though. No way, Boob, you're way cuter. Oh, okay. I was like... Oh, those cost money. We learn. Activated just by being in the inventory. Okay. Okay, he's gonna gain. Oh, status effects like rage, corruption, and poison can be applied to heroes and enemies. Mouse over the icons to see the effects. Uh, they both have passives. Okay, so enemies have passive skills as well. So, we explode is zero, destroy this, deal 20 damage to all. Mmm, okay. He's got a lot of HP. And he's gonna gain armor every turn. Heck yeah, chain detonation. I'm glad we picked that up. Already working out. Already got a little build going. Oh, okay. I'm already super in to chain detonation. I was like, how many, how many times can it realistically happen? It's like max 10, like, can that even really? Yes. Get him, boop. Handled. Boom. I wonder what the score is based off of. I wonder if it does anything. Um, you know what, let's, yeah. What if we got a, what if we got a second level critical strike? Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna upgrade this. Two weak to all enemies. Which means they're weak the first two turns, which is very nice. Um, this is probably just 100 gold. Yep, it's 100 gold every time. Uh, ooh. That refreshes? Great upgrade. Great upgrade. This doesn't, yeah, this doesn't have to be in the inventory. This can be there. Okay. Good to, good to be sure how that works. So I'm guessing... Potion Granny... 
So we go to the shop. Now the shop has four things. Mm hmm. Mm. Eight damage to a random enemy four times. Okay. All right. We got. Mm. Got a bunch of stuff. This is interesting. Potion granny. Look at her. She's she's a little like snail lady. Hello, dearies. Hello. You? Grams, darling. Who is this young man? Uh, Koa, meet potion granny. Granny, meet Koa. Ah, how lovely. Do come in. I've got a nice batch of potions fresh out of the oven. And come on, Koa. Let's not keep granny waiting. No, seriously. Let's not keep her waiting. Why are we whispering? Everything all right, dearies? Oh, of course, Miss Potion. We're coming. Potions and consumables are powerful tools. Drag and drop them in your inventory. Great. Uh, yep. So if we've got money. We can we can re up. Yeah. Okay. I I don't have a I don't have a lot of money. Um. Oh snap! We got a massive surge of special energy coming towards the mothership. Ah, so it's just it's it's flat rewards for the battle. Koa, boop, stay close by. We're in for a bumpy ride. Okay. We're set. I do appreciate that you can you can adjust. All right. Give him. Nice. See, that's all we need. He's gonna gain twenty. Let's get some damage on him. Nice little extra five. So this is a 40% chance to crit. So there's definitely some interesting math to do of like if you get a high enough crit chance, this might do more damage overall. Yeah, because right there I did 20, which is more than this, but this has 100% crit chance. This does 20 base. So that's a thing to keep in mind. Put weak on him for his next turn. I mean, this would be the turn to hit him with weak, but that's fine. I, you know, I don't remember. I do like this when uh, any hero deals damage, 30% chance to add five block to a random hero. You love to see that. Just, you know, you just get some damage out there. See what, see what you can do. See, we refresh that, so we're just smacking him around. And we're managing his damage really well. Ten to all heroes. If we weaken him, it's still ten to all heroes. So. Oh, I didn't need to do it for to him. That's. Fifteen times three. That's a heck of a lot of damage, my dude. I mean, I guess, listen, I'll just use it because I have the mana. <laughs> Who knew I was so strong? Pow! Three hundred coins. Love it. Oh. 
First critical hit gains piercing, can't be blocked. First critical hit dealt each turn adds 10 to all heroes. I mean, I can just put it on him. That's fine. He can just he can just do what he's doing. Whew, you weren't kidding. That guy was nasty. Oh, well done, my boy. Not many can go up against the slicer and walk away with all their fingers. Let's head back to the ship. I'm sure Magmama has plenty for us to clean up. Hell yeah! Those guys didn't stand a chance! Great work, my boy. We'll make a dimensional out of you yet. <laughs> we make a pretty awesome team too, huh, Boop? Oh, yeah! Hey, so Gramps, what are these Spectre things anyway? Whoa! Oh. That? That's bad. That's the that's Gramps, the bad alarm. What's going on? I don't think we're out of the woods yet, Koa. Uh, Gramps? Oh. What the hell is that? Ragnarath. That's the definition of not out of the woods. Oh, dag. Oh. Whoa. No, Grandpa went Super Saiyan. Will not succumb to your tyranny. <laughs> My legacy is not over yet. Be safe, Koa. The rip take you, Ragnarok! Heck yeah. Get him, Grandpa. Gramps. To be continued. Kid. Kid, wake up. Huh? Gramps? He's gone. What do you mean gone? Listen up. All remaining crew of the mothership. Initializing code zero. We got an army of specters on the loose and our dimensionals are stranded across the multiverse. We need to find and reunite them all. We want any hope of rescuing Gramps from Ragnarath. Give me the locations of Inferna. Thunder Gust. Oh wow, look at that guy. Terra Fey. Aquanaut. Pyropause. Fung ass. <laughs> okay, fung ass is pretty great. <laughs> Anyone else you can. Don't no grab to the challenge, kid. We were only just getting started. I'm sorry, I can't get over fung ass. <gasps> oh, feedback. I love fung gas. Oh. Well, that, I mean, you know, listen, was that a short demo? Kind of, but also, you got, you got everything you need. You got everything you need. Master Raid, conquer the ultimate procedurally generated roguelike adventure, save the multiverse from the dastardly rag. I'm, okay, we can, listen, we'll do a little. We'll, we'll, we'll poke our head in here. We'll see what this is. We'll see what this looks like. Do I pick my team? I pick my team. Oh, wow. Look at you can at least see them. So I can shork. OK. Defeat the master raid one time. Defeat the master raid with both shork and aquanaut in your party without either of them dying. Oh, that's fun. I always like having uh, I was I was like having extra uh, um, like, what's it called? I like extra unlocks, like for challenges and stuff. All right, we'll, 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 we'll see how this goes. Cosmic Guardian, hello. Are you, you in charge? Are you the boss? The rift ahead is perilous dimensionals. Our end beckons that you stand against it, small as you are. Come, rise above the challenge. I will help you. 
Apocalypse mode? I don't want to click that button. Upgrade hero slot. Oh. Okay, well that's that he got an extra thing. I'm glad I didn't click apocalypse mode. Who knows what that Who knows what we're looking at there? All right. We got our boy Sh our boy Shork. Um Ten block, deal damage equal to block to target enemy. Two cooldown. So he he needs he needs a regular. Pop. Popped. First three turns of battle, he gains ten and has guard. Opponents can only target this character. That's pretty great. I didn't realize that was his passive. So so he taunts them the first three turns of the battle and gains 10 block each turn. Um, 70 damage to target creature. Oh, oh, reflector. Yeah, let's just let's just get reflector. Just that's a that's a great opener. Hey, I like I like the idea of getting Koa like a like a four power thing, but let's uh let's let's think about what we can do um mm. deal additional damage oh you can right click to see the upgrade that's very interesting um All right. Okay, okay, okay. I appreciate that this isn't so much about um, putting, um, like, like getting the, the, the correct cards for all of this. It's about, uh, you know, managing your mana each turn, managing your your gold. Um, and. You know, upgrading your heroes in an interesting way, it's it's it's, it's you know, slay the spire adjacent. Um, but not. Uh, not exactly the same, not wildly different. Like it's it's a, it's a very neat evolution on this uh, card base system, which I really like. All right, let's do deal additional damage. Okay. Well, I wasn't able to block that. So that's, I think, going to be the big difference between uh, running Shork and running Gramps. Is I mean, and, hey, listen, there's nothing stopping me from getting that. Um, There's nothing stopping me from getting that that defensive card because I, I assume that's just a normal card. Deal 20. Uh, wow. Deal 20 damage two times. Now we'll we'll wait until we're in the battle. We might. Yeah, so so for the first three turns.
Get 300 gold. Get a rare skill. Choose a relic. Give me a relic. Mm. Gain 50. Love that. Extra 50? Love to see it. Spectre Crystalline Bomb. No. I'm just gonna take the regular. It's one of those things I'm like, I'm like, I, I know what that guy does. Now here's gonna be the problem. He's not gonna do a lot of, um, a lot of damage. He's he's mostly gonna be stacking up. Good crits. I don't, I don't know, I don't, I don't know if we're gonna. I don't know if we're gonna have this one, gang. Ow. All right. So there's our defend card we were talking about. That's pretty good. First three critical hits per turn. Refresh all skills on that hero. 30 damage to target enemy. If that skill's a critical, apply a weak. 30%. We're, let's, let's get defend. It's not attractive. It's not sexy. But we need to have it. We need to have it. We're also going to heal. We're also going to heal. Oh, I was dragging the wrong thing. I was dragging the wrong thing. I got it. I was doing the wrong. I was just. I was just. I just didn't read it. This is going so much faster than I thought it was going to. Um. So I've noticed we're not gaining XP. I wonder if that's just a a, a demo thing. Is that a thing that is is that a meta progression thing? You know? Oh my gosh! <laughs> because he hit him three times! Oh, he... Yeah, that, yeah, mm-hmm, that was good. That made me feel good. Oh, see, if I'd applied that weak, I wouldn't have, mm, see, that's what I gotta learn. I gotta learn. Mm, that's good. No, you don't need to do that. Oh, that range just stacks. Okay, then. Oh. Okay. 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 Shork big hit. Oh, get him, buddy. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, buddy. 
Um, Twenty damage to all enemies. If the enemy dies, gain two mana this turn and refresh. Yeah. Yeah. That's. Yeah, that's good. Okay, let's go to the shop. Because we haven't been to the shop. Chain detonator. Uh, deadly focus, chain strike. All right, there we go. That's that's what I needed. Thank you very much. Uh, let's try the elite fight. I wonder if the XP markers on that. We'll learn in a minute. Uh, that's meta progression. You know, if it's like, oh yeah, you're you know you're stacking up experience for the end. Block does not expire at the end of its turn. When it's Block is broken, deal 15 damage to all heroes. That's, um, that's a lot. And I'm gonna be honest, I'm not, um, like very excited. Um, we're gonna swap that because he's, he, 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 this is, this is what you swap in when there's like, when you're fighting like a bunch of players. <laughs> You know? Oh, I... Okay, I could have attacked him. That's... That wasn't the... Hmm... So he just... So what he's gonna do... Well, that's, um, that's dimensionals. Hey, if I'd finished that, would I have gotten meta progression progress? Whatever. Uh, hey, it's a demo. It's a demo, friends. Um, so yeah, this is, this is dimensionals. This was great. This is great. Um, this does the thing that a lot of, you know, uh, roguelike deck builders uh, don't excite me about, and not necessarily that they do it wrong, but more that this is what I find enjoyable, where they give you a lot of buttons and facets to mess with. You know, uh, I really enjoy all of these playable heroes. Um, the idea that they have different passives, different skills, different synergies. Um, you know, you could upgrade all of the different, uh, all the different powers, all the different items. You have relics and abilities and passives. Who knows what else? Um, can I right click? Oh, oh, so you can, oh, as you get skill, mm -hmm. look at this. Love that. Okay. So yeah, this is, this is, this is good. This is good. This is great. This is good. This is great. Um, I'm a big fan. I'm definitely going to wishlist this. If you want to check it out for yourself, the Steam, the link to the Steam page will be in the description. If the demo is still available, hey, it'll be there. You should check it out. Um, if not, make sure to wishlist it. It'll let you know when it goes on sale, if it has another demo going on. Um, and wishlisting helps indie devs a whole lot. It helps with visibility. It helps with, you know, getting that Steam algorithm to show your game. If you want to see more Steam Next Fest demos, the link to that playlist, Matt checks out season two will be in the description. Season one will be in the description as well. A whole bunch of stuff will be in the description. If you wanna come by the Twitch stream, I stream five days a week, you come check that out. If not, YouTube has all kinds of VODs that I'm constantly uploading more because there's always, there's always more to stream. I just said I stream five days a week. Um, so, love to see you on the Twitch stream. If not, 
You can check out the Twitch VODs. Have a good time over here. Either way, until next time, be well. Do good.